Upma, Upyamavu or Upatu is a dish originating from the Indian subcontinent, most common in South Indian, Maharashtrian, and Sri Lankan Tamil breakfast, cooked as a thick porridge from dry roasted semolina or coarse rice flour. Various seasonings and or vegetables are often added during the cooking, depending on individual preferences. Today it is popular in most parts of India and is prepared in various ways. Etymology In many Dravidian languages, the word uppu means salt and pindi, mavu or hitu means flour, hence the name upindi, upyamavu or upatu. In North India, it is called upma. Preparation Upma is usually made with semolina called rava or suji in India. The very basic method involves lightly dry roasting the rava and mixing it thoroughly with a little salt and some boiling hot water. There are many ways upma is prepared, indeed, every upma cook usually will incorporate variations in flavor when making upma. This variation is obtained by varying or emphasizing particular spices. Major variations Suji <inaudible> upma The most popular version with wide variations of upma are made with whole or refined ground wheat and rice of varied grain size, vermicelli. Sometimes a wide range of vegetables may be added, and may be garnished with a variety of beans raw or sprouted, cashew and peanuts. For a variation called masala upma known as karabath in Karnataka, sambar masala or garam masala is added along with red chili powder, instead of green chilies. This variety is more popular in Karnataka, Maharashtra, Tamil Nadu and parts of Andhra Pradesh and is usually served in South Indian restaurants. Whole wheat upma Whole wheat or wheat dahlia cracked wheat is known for its nutritional benefits. In Tamil Nadu samba wheat rava traditional wheat is used and is very popular in Coimbatore region where it is had as breakfast or dinner. Usually eaten with banana and ghee or curd and pickle and also served with chutney and sambar. Sometimes cooked with vegetables like peas, carrots, and beans for a fulfilling meal. Rice upma The rice upma, which is mainly popular in Tamil Nadu and southern parts of Karnataka is referred to as akki tari upatu, rice coarse flour upatu Another variant of upma is prepared with grated coconuts instead of onions, especially on holy days, when onion is avoided. This type of upma is generally smeared with ghee at the end of preparation. Dishes similar to upma can be made by substituting small crumbs of leftover bread or idli instead of flour. Upma made from coarser rava known as sajig is a dish of Udupi cuisine. It is sometimes served along with snacks such as sautéed and spiced poha or shevdu. Corn upma Another variation is corn upma which serves as a healthy breakfast due to the ingredients like corn, milk and nuts, curry leaves are added for flavor. Kesari bath In Karnataka, upma is also served with another common sweet dish of Karnataka, kesari bath, kesari bat with a scoop of each on one plate, in a presentation commonly called, chow chow bath. Aval upma, Adakulu upma In Andhra Pradesh, upma made with flattened rice in place of semolina is called Adakulu upma. Adakulu upma This variant is also known as Aval upma in the Chennai region when made with rice flakes similar to poha. Vermicelli upma A popular light evening snack is upma made with vermicelli and tomato, peas and carrot. Topic: 
Topic: <laughs> Upma served with Gugni. In most parts of Odisha, a popular breakfast consists of suji upma served with gugni. Topic: See also List of porridges Broken rice Couscous Food portal <laughs>